this morning we woke up. She hardly slept. Bridesmaids and I had croissants and sausage rolls. I knew the day had come that we were handing her over. I felt very happy that Rebecca had got together with a great guy. The hairdresser came, started doing all of us. We popped some champagne. Rebecca was very excited. The Rolls Royce came to take me and my parents and my sister. We drove here. And there was a lot of excitement. I'm looking forward to the day. Exciting. There was a lot of preparation for a really great young couple to come together in a great relationship. Butterflies in the room, making sure I look perfect. She was quite taken with how beautiful she looked as well. Woke up in the morning, had a text from Becca saying hey, expressing a few nerves and uh, are we looking forward to the day? We got this morning and I'm quite excited about looking forward to the wedding. Busy morning, lots of things to do. I always need more time to get ready, us girls. Once I was dressed, I started feeling a little bit nervous. Got to the bar and kind of calmed down a little bit. Everything was all set up. Well, it seemed unusually calm. Bit of a concern about the speech later, but that kind of left. Pretty much his normal self, confident, cheeky, happy. And everyone seemed to be enjoying themselves. Me everyone and you think it's nice to see everyone all dressed really well everyone's there to see you and everyone wants to see you and it is lovely to have your family and friends together i was at the aisles the only time i really was getting a bit like nervous i hope that you were okay and see what you look like once we made into the barn to walk down the aisle i felt really excited oliver looked quite handsome but rebecca looked stunning when she walked in i had a tear in my eye rebecca's dress was flowing over our shoes so the risk was that we actually tripped our own daughter up as we came up the aisle don't trip on my dress, trying not to cry. There was a bet on about who would or would not cry, and I managed it. I bit my lip once. As they were going through their vows, it was so obvious that he's in love with her, which made me very happy for my daughter. I give you this ring. As a sign of our marriage. And a symbol of our love. I promise to care for you. To respect and cherish you. Throughout our lives together. I carry your heart with me. I carry it in my heart. I am never without it. If you have love in your life, it can help. If you do not have it, no matter what else there is, it is not enough. You are now husband and wife. It's a beautiful day. We're looking for something dumb to do. Hey, baby, I think I want to marry you. Is it the look in your eyes? Or is it this dancing juice? Who cares, baby? I think I want to marry you. At some point in Atlanta, we needed some more visa paperwork and I explained to Rebecca we still hadn't got our green cards and that we wouldn't be able to travel back to England as regularly. And then she said loudly in this quiet restaurant, but daddy, we used to own the place. <laughs> it's the woman who chooses the man and she's always made very good decisions in her life. We've become best friends, all three of us and everyone at this table. It's not just going out, it's not just having dinner. We used to lay in bed together for hours and watch TV. Like we became best, best, best friends. Just to let you know, Ollie, not only are you stuck with Rebecca, but you're stuck with all of us. <laughs> Thank you to Rebecca for showing up and becoming my wife today. But the best part about this story is that he was asking me to be his best man before he'd actually asked Becca to marry him. <laughs> That's a man with confidence there. wish you both all of the happiness in the world. Hold each other tight. Beautiful day and I think their future looks shiny and hope it continues. Good luck and best wishes. I'm sure they'll be married as long as we have. Thank you for organising such a fantastic wedding so that we can get married and look forward to every day in the future. Ollie, I love you and this day has been perfect and I can't wait to spend the rest of my life with you. Who cares, baby? I think I want to marry you. Now we get to party. <laughs>